can you elaborate a little bit on the mirror node roadmap? Is the current system of buckets that mirror node operators pay to access the way that you would like to run it in the future, or do you envision a different setup? Oh, both. We'll keep this way and a new way. So let's talk about mirror nodes. Right now, what we have are mirror nodes, both Hedera runs one and also the community are running a bunch of mirror nodes. And they watch everything that's happening on the network and let you, they'll answer questions for you. Uh, you could also imagine someone who just wants to run a mirror node for their own private use and they wouldn't open it up to the world, they would just run their own. All of this is possible. The way it works right now is that the network, every node on the network uploads what's going on to a server, just a bunch of files to a server and then anyone in the world can download those from the server. And if you run a mirror node, mirror node software is free. You can download the software and then it can be set up so that it's constantly going to that server and downloading those files. If you want to, you can do that. Alternatively, what you can do in the future is run the other kind of mirror node and we will build that as well. And so what that will be is a computer that is acting almost like a, like a mainnet node. It's doing not consensus, but it's doing all of the processing of the, uh, of the transactions and it's internally doing consensus. It's not voting in the consensus, but it's reproducing, recalculating the consensus. So if you imagine you have the main net where they're all talking to each other and gossiping, they gossip these events, the little blocks of, of transactions. And then each one, when it builds up a pile of events can calculate what the consensus is and then it can process all the transactions in order to update the state. The mirror nodes will form their own network and gossip with each other. And the main net nodes will occasionally send an event to a mirror node. And that's it, one way traffic. So the mirror nodes aren't talking to the main net, the main net is talking to the mirror nodes. And then the mirror nodes are gossiping among themselves. So everyone gets all the events. They can't manipulate them because the events are digitally signed by the main net nodes. So the mirror nodes are an entirely separate network in a real sense. They can't hurt the main net. They can gossip them, they can all find out what they are, and then they do the exact same thing the mainnet does using the exact same code. And so when you pile, when you build up a pile of these events, you now can calculate the consensus locally, you can figure out all the transactions in the right order, and then you can process them and update the state. And the mirror nodes can do the same thing the mainnet nodes do, they just have a state that's evolving in time. And the states have digital signatures on them from the mainnet. And so one mirror node could give another mirror node the state uh, when, it's, when it joins. And so it'll, it'll act very much like the mainnet. The code for it will be very much like the mainnet code. It'll just be a tweak to the mainnet code where you have a, a flag that says, I'm a mirror node. Uh, it will mean that you have to do as much computation and, and have the bandwidth of a mirror a mainnet node. So maybe you wouldn't want to do that. But it means that you'll have lower latency. You don't have to wait for the file to go off to that server and come back down. You kind of get it immediately. And you also will be knowing for sure that the code you think the mainnet is running, it really is running because you'll watch the state evolving over time. And um, if, if you got out of sync, then you, you would know it. Uh, I mean, you, you, you'd actually instantly, they would tell you there'd be an error message if you ever got out of sync. And so these new, this new kind of mirror node will be able to um, give you all those benefits. So that's something we'll do. Uh, I think that there's interest in that, but I also think that there's a lot of people that are interested in continuing to run the current kind of mirror node. And so we'll have both. 